Here we go then, guys. We are back today with a bit of MX5. Now, I've um, lost a bit of my mojo with iRacing recently. Did a Ferrari fix the other day and wasn't particularly quick, which is kind of normal, I guess. But um, just really felt like my racecraft wasn't there in any sim I've been racing. So I really wanted to not ruin anyone else's race. So decided that we'd go for rookies. So we're in the Masters at Laguna Seca, which is a great combination. In the new Masters with the sequential box, which I haven't driven yet, so always a bit of fun. And, uh, well, let's see how it went. Back on the triple screens as well, because... Fancy giving them a go. We was assuming that flooring it was the right idea, it seemed to work. A little bit of contact up front. Not sure where he is. My first lap cautiousness not really doing me any favours there. These are great little cars to drive, though. Definitely would drive these more. Just try and keep in the draft train. And then look to pounce if we can make any moves on anyone. I heard some crashing, but I'm not really sure where from. I think it was behind me. Oh, right, this is going to be a good chance. Yeah. Brave enough on the brakes at the inside, which I think I could be next time. One down. <laughs> Let's get right up behind him. Rosa. Gone defensive. See if we can make him break too late. Yeah, nice defending, Kenneth. Good job, man. Just absolutely swung into my line when I'm on the inside. Nice one. Oh, there we go. Giving it a bit. Not on purpose at all. <laughs> Watch it back in replay, my friend. I'm literally on the inside of a faster car and you swing in front of I apologise for the language. So Alright, here we go. We still need two more positions. These guys are... Faster than me in qualifying. And they get momentum out of there, actually. It's fine, man. It happened. Oh, cheeky off track there. Right, if we can get anywhere near him, he seems to have got confident now in the tyres order, but I've gone hot into there, that's not helping. Getting rapidly caught by the guy behind as well. I always tilt my head, I don't know. <laughs> don't know why I do that. Right, here we go. We don't want to lose 20 I rating, that would be really annoying. Key of these cars is momentum. You want everything to be smooth and lose as little speed as possible everywhere. Which I'm struggling with at the moment. It's been like I said, it's been a long time since I've driven these. Oh, 
Oh, this guy's catching me ridiculously fast. He has got a 1.8k rating, I suppose, so he's better than me. If he got all of that in the Masters, and he's definitely faster than me in here, he's... My poultry 1.6 comes from just about every discipline there ever was. I just figured to race properly though. Been having a crisis of confidence lately. With regards to my ability to race cleanly, so... I thought back to the rookies and just... Go for it. See what happens. Obviously, there's no rookies in this one. So. We're just going to have to rely on a bit of luck, I think, to get us a few more positions. Can't see anyone fighting particularly hard at the moment, though, so. We might not get anyone else to knock each other off. Well, I mean, this guy might. <laughs> A little bit wrong on it. Let's see if we can try and follow him up to these guys. Don't think we will. Screw it under brakes. These are sort of cars that I could race a lot of. Cars don't, as I always say, cars don't have to be fast to make good racing. And in fact, normally the opposite is completely true. The slower the car, the better the racing. I just haven't got the pace. To be fair, it's quite often true of me, so. <laughs> That's something to particularly worry about. Oh, he's gone. We all cut that corner. your position. I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it. Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> Who came out? Axel Brown. What the fuck did he break, Jerry? We just gotta hold it now. You can do it, Wilkins. Just 
hold your position. It's got to run on me. Got to run on me. Bro, I'm so fucking sorry. I caught the dirt and I couldn't stop. I'm really sorry, mate. I was on the brakes so early. Sorry, Don't worry, man. Yeah, these things happen, don't they? Well, there goes the eye rating, but uh. <laughs> The car feels drivable, just. Don't think we're going to make up the places. To get back into... Positive eye rating, though. Let's keep pushing, let's keep pushing. Nothing to lose now, is it? Well, that cloud was a big puff of smoke then. I was getting all excited. Ooh, understeer. <laughs> To one place back. No, this guy's back. It's so rapid. So fucking fast. Biggest problem we have here is this guy is much faster than me. But I'd rather lose 5 I rating than 20. Don't know where he was. Right. A bit of a zero contact anyway, it's alright. <laughs> you can tell I'm trying because I've gone really quiet. Well, back down to minus 20 I rating. Keep fighting, we'll keep pushing. You never know. He just carries so much more speed than me through these corners.
fair play. I can't do it. <laughs> I like to watch someone that can. We're anywhere near finishing the race yet. Feels like we're not. Well, apparently we've gone to 16 minutes. I don't know how that's happened. Oh, it's count down from there. Right, last lap. There we go. Well, boys and girls, that was a, uh, I wouldn't say action pack, but a few bits happened, didn't they? We had a few bits of good, a few bits of bad. Let's see how the next one plays out. P8 is pretty terrible. So it sounds like P8 in my normal class of racing would be a... Uh... Wow, wow, wow. Good. So close. That was so close. Nice job, man. Yeah, P8 in my normal class out of like 20, 30 cars would be good. P8 out of like 11 people. And as you can see, wasn't quite the result we were looking for, but these things happen. It was good fun. We had a nice race. The guy that hit me apologised, so we can't complain too much, can we? Anyway, hope to see you on the next video.